Hello and welcome to uh, door number three of our advanced calendar. After the high tech, <laughs> you look so <slow. laughs> After the high tech show of yesterday, again today we have not uh, uh, been afraid of cost and invested very heavily in something to punish Ben. Why do we punish you, Ben? <laughs> Why do we punish you? Uh, I made Marty's sick. Stay at home. You made Marty sick and stay at home. That's right. So you're sorry? Very sorry. Okay, you can take off the mask. <laughs> <laughs> right. So there's Ben. <laughs> yeah, Marty is unfortunately sick at home. Uh, ben first of all was sick, then he made me sick, and then he made Marty sick. So thank you. Mr. Pestilence. <laughs> Mr. Pestilence, all right. Um, so what we want to do today is uh, talk a little bit about uh, some of the events of last year. And uh, we wanted to talk about all of the shows we went to. Yeah, we did a lot of traveling yeah. last year. Yeah. So yeah, this is our uh, Christmas special travel report. Yep, the 2013 in uh, review, so to speak. Yeah. All right, cool. So we have a couple of events we want mm -hmm. to talk about. It's going to be a two-day uh, show. So yeah. we're going to do the first part today mm -hmm. and the second part tomorrow. All right. And uh, we will talk about the Spring Angel. Mm -hmm. We'll talk about uh, the Games Day US Memphis, Games Day Germany, uh, Euro Militaire, Games Day UK, Games Day Italy, so many shows are <laughs> in uh, Poland, and then of course we have uh, Monte San Savino. The Monte San Savino show, yeah. Um, couple of events we couldn't go to last year, or we don't have pictures. Yeah. You went to Painting Crusade? Uh, I also went to Painting Crusade, mm. lovely show. Uh, I just forgot to take uh, pictures. <laughs> Maybe you should put on the mask. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, let's uh, start it off with the first event. Okay. So I just already started with the highlight. Yeah, definitely. Spring Angel Moscow. Spring Angel Moscow, uh, a fine event. Uh, it's the second uh, live show they had. Yeah. Uh, last year was the first, and I had the honor to be uh, invited as a judge mm -hmm. together with uh, Matt Sexfish and uh, Jose, Jose Manuel Palomares Nunes. J and M P. Yeah. J M N P. Yeah. Uh, something like that. <laughs> yes. And um, now I would say it's an awesome show. Yeah, definitely uh, worth a trip. Uh, Moscow seems quite far away, but it's actually not that far away. Right. And um, I mean, actually, it was pretty cheap to get there. Yeah, I have to say. In the end, I mean, we were all a little, a little bit afraid, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, definitely. So um, uh, all of the shows, we want to kind of uh, give a score. Perfect score would be. 42. 42 <laughs> points, who would, yes. who would have guessed? So you can actually get, uh, there's four categories. The first category is community, which for us is the most important part. Uh, the second part is the miniatures. And we're talking more about the quality, not so much about the quantity. Uh, then the venue itself. Yeah, the venue itself is always very important yeah. uh, it, because it is like the home for the whole ambience. Yeah. And then the last one would be the show itself. So what is, what is offered basically, what, what, what can you do during the event and so on. So uh, you can get 10 points in each category, and then you can earn two extra points <laughs> for being specially hoopy. <laughs> right. Right. Okay, so Spring Angel. Spring Angel uh, gets 8, po eight points for uh, community. Yes. Uh, awesome people, you meet a lot of the Russian painters yes. that you usually don't meet on the shows yeah. in, uh, all around Europe. Mm -hmm. Then for miniatures, uh, we gave it 9. Yeah. Um, actually, it was not so few, but it wasn't also like crowded with miniatures. Yeah. But the quality was very high. The, the quality is high, and the, the style is also pretty different uh, yeah. to, to what you see on other on, shows. On other shows, yes, yeah. absolutely. Um, then the venue. The venue was really, really nice. Yeah. It's uh, Hotel Sal Salut. <laughs> yeah, a big uh, Russian hotel. Yeah. Um, yeah. But like a conference hotel. Yes. You also stayed at the hotel, right? Yes, I did, yeah. yeah. No, it was really nice, but uh, I mean, the whole way the, sh the show was organized, the lighting, the display of the miniatures and so on, I think that was really, really good. Yeah. yeah. And then we have uh, the show itself. The show itself. The show itself is really amazing. Yeah. Uh, Sergey and Katie, the organizers, took care of everything. The event is free, um, so everyone can, can enter. Uh, Kids, students, yeah. So you don't have like a, a big cost to get in there. No, fifty euros for yeah. nothing. Yeah. <laughs> for example, yeah. And they offer free food, free yeah. drinks. It's just yeah, you get a free breakfast buffet, free lunch buffet, and it's it's amazing. I mean, um, uh, the amount of uh, money they're spending just on promoting the hobby in Russia is is awesome. Which is why they also get the plus one Katie and Sergey bonus. <laughs> 
So uh, that comes to a total of 37 points. Yeah, out of 42, that's pretty good. <laughs> Second trip, June Games Day US. Awesome event. Yeah, by, by far the farthest, dis farthest distance we went. And the travel with the suitcases was over the It was <laughs> a lot of fun. <laughs> it was amazing because we had a huge diorama yeah. and two different boxes. Each uh, of us had to carry one box. Yeah. And so um, many people talked to us on the airports. Yeah, 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 yeah. Insane. It was crazy. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, no, it was a great event, I have to say. Yeah. Um, the um, community factor nine? Nine. Yeah. Definitely. Uh, a lot of Americans we met. I mean, yeah. the whole gang went to on Beale Street and a lot of fun with those guys. And uh, it was just awesome, awesome feeling. Just really family feeling there, wasn't it? Yeah. We had we had the, um, the the barbecue place we went to with yeah. the big group and stuff. So it was also really nice. Yeah. Um, people took a lot of care that we felt at home. Yeah, absolutely. Um, then the um, miniatures we gave it seven yeah. points. Yeah. Uh, which kind of seems a little low maybe, but uh, it really isn't. Um, in the in the top class, I would say it was no different from anywhere else. Yeah. Really awesome stuff like yeah. Aaron's really miniatures really and top. Uh, really, really good. And um, but it's kind of like games in Germany where there's a lot of uh, uh, kind of mid-level miniatures. Maybe even more so than in Germany. I think more than in Germany. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. But uh, seven points is pretty good for me. Yeah. The venue itself, seven points. Mm -hmm. I think the big plus for the venue is that it's located in the city center and you yeah. can go out and have a drink <coughs> anywhere. Yeah, uh, anywhere you want. Yeah, Beard Street was fun. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, it's just a, a convention center, like convention centers are. But it was it was uh, definitely appropriate. Yeah. Then uh, the show itself, eight points. Mm -hmm. It's pretty high. Yeah. Um, and I'd say um, there's a couple of things we would like to talk about. Um, first of all, that uh, we felt really appreciated there by uh, Games Workshop America. Yeah. Uh, we were all invited for a barbecue and that um, was really nice. We received like a really nice little letter. Uh, it has a, a seal of a dark angels on there. Uh, we received, unfortunately, five weeks after the show, a second uh, letter with the with the uh, envelope for the tickets and stuff. <laughs> At least we had the tickets, which was good. Um, every customer got a swag bag. Yeah. So I know some of you guys are still waiting for this. They will be sent out this week, I promise. Um, but there's stuff in there like uh, differently uh, colored uh, cups, cups and badges. badges. We got the, the drink holder, uh, the drink, what's it called? Bottle? Saki. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it's, I think uh, uh, really appreciated. The people there were very nice. I mean, you really felt welcome and you really felt it's, it's I mean, how, how uh, shows are often in America. You really, really feel welcome. Yeah. But it was genuine. It was not just mm -hmm. like, like a show. It was really yeah. nice. So, um, uh, that actually gives them a plus one. Of course, we tell it. Yeah. yeah, so 32 points, well done. And if we can afford it, we'll come back next year, definitely. That's really nice. Okay, next event, also a Games Day. Yeah, in August. In the, Germany. The German Games yes. Day. And uh, community? 10 points. 10 points, yeah. Um, we've established a big, big meetup uh, for years now. Yeah. Um, and uh, last year we were over 100. This year was a little less, but almost 100 people. Yeah, yeah. And I think uh, because we always meet after the, the dinner, we always meet in the lobby and have a look at the miniatures. And I think we're, we were around 100 people. So yeah, yeah, yeah. that was really nice. Yeah. And we also go to the show. Yeah. <laughs> so, so we go there for the community and uh, we end up also going to the show. Yeah. Um, so the miniatures at Games Day uh, Germany also seven points, similar yeah. to America. Um, uh, I would say this year was kind of weird because there was just so few people there. Yeah. Uh, there were a lot of high class people because of the cancelled uh, Games Day in uh, France, uh, France, France, Spain. Spain. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but there was also a lot of medium and also lower uh, mm -hmm. level uh, miniatures. So some of the categories weren't very full. Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, definitely, the, the seven points includes one point for min one minus point for lighting because that was just yeah. The, you know, the lighting is uh, is it's uh, insane. insane. Yeah. It's so yellow. Yeah. It's but uh, people you could put a candle <laughs> in there. <everywhere. laughs> like, people who visit the German games they know it. Yeah, it's been bad for ten years now. Yeah. Venue nine points. Yeah, the really? venue the venue is awesome. Uh, it's it's always been there in yeah. the, in the Gutsnich in Cologne. It's uh, kind of a old medieval kind of feel to it. Yeah. Like big hallways and catacombs and stuff. And and it's arches, really nice. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's really beautiful. Yeah. Then the show itself, seven points. Yeah, I mean they tried their best to to offer something uh, for the uh, for the money for the money for, for the, the shit of money. <laughs> so, can I say <laughs> shit on <the> camera? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but 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 I think in the in the limits they're working within. Uh, obviously, uh, I, I'd say the organization team did a really yeah. good job. Yeah, we had the show painting was yes. is always important and fun. Yeah. Um, 
And, and there was still some activities. The shopping area was pretty large, but there was still like a little gaming going on and, and these kind of things. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, so um, uh, unfortunately, minus one point for customer appreciation uh, because of the price. I mean, yeah, 50 euros for nothing. The price rise uh, was yeah. quite big. Yeah. So uh, uh, they, a lot of people didn't go. I mean, yeah. was, uh, they sold half the tickets. Okay. So that is uh, 32 points altogether? Yeah, it's still pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Then I went to Euromilitaire in Folksen yeah. in September. Awesome show. Now you weren't there, so shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I've been there! Oh, you've been there before. That's yeah, that's yeah, great. yeah, that's great. Now, uh, I would say definitely one of the highlights of this year uh, as well. Um, we got um, Community 9 points. Uh, for me, what was really nice is when, of, of course, I already knew a lot of English people, but there's also a lot of historic painters, a lot of historic scale painters. Models. You got scale monitors, you got uh, diorama specialists, uh, light boxes, and uh, also people from all over the world. Yeah. We got uh, uh, the South Koreans were there and so mm -hmm. on. So I really, really lo loved the show. Uh, unfortunately, it was a two-day show. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I spent one hour actually just rushing through taking pictures of the miniatures because I just talked to people the whole time. Yeah, yeah. Um, but community is always yeah. the important, yeah. and most important part. Yeah, yeah. Um, then we have the uh, miniatures, mm -hmm. nine, um, yeah. a lot of miniatures. I think it was like 800 or something. Yeah. And from all different categories. You got fantasy, you got sci-fi, you got of course a lot of historic busts, dioramas. The figures, variety, like, the variety of uh, figures that you see on that show is really yeah. amazing. I think that alone is reason to go to your military. Yeah. Absolutely. Then the venue, yeah. It's nice. <laughs> I mean, how, how much nicer can it get? It's yeah, like, the the Lee's uh, Cliff Hall is so nice. It's yeah. It's a bit like a, in a James Bond movie, it's a venue built in the cliffs, so you see the, the channel behind the figure. Yeah. It's really beautiful. Yeah, and they also have beer there. It's yeah. beer, not sure. <laughs> <laughs> so it was good. The show, nine points, I would say. Um, there were, uh, at least to my knowledge, not so many like uh, painting master classes and so on, but uh, a lot of vendors. Yeah. Um, so you can buy anything from books to lamps to any kind of gadgetry you can imagine. And of course, all the big uh, uh, miniature manufacturers were there as well. Yeah. Definitely a nice show. And uh, plus one point for variety, because that's really the only yeah. show I've seen. Maybe with uh, Mont San Sabino uh, mm -hmm. being a close second there. Yeah. Uh, where you can see all kinds of, of uh, uh, types of modeling and, and miniature painting. So uh, that's a total of 38 points. Very well done. All right, and that already concludes part one of our review of last year, the first yeah. four shows. And we'll be back with more tomorrow. Definitely. And tomorrow, again... Tomorrow! <laughs> tomorrow! tomorrow. <laughs> Matthew's not here, but tomorrow! <laughs> tomorrow we will have a lot of beautiful uh, shows to talk about. Yes. But we will record them now. <laughs> <laughs> tomorrow, tomorrow. <laughs>